Hi guys, this is Chris from Barrow Motorcycle Sales and today I've got this absolutely stunning looking KTM 125 Duke that's the official name for it and um, this one's got just over 1100 miles on it it's a 2018 bike actually bought in December 2018 so um, yeah, it's uh, just absolutely gorgeous. Really nice condition. Check out all the panels. Um, no damage to any of the panels. Or the wheels or anything. It's been serviced at around 800 miles. So it doesn't need a service. No marks or scuffs on any of the uh, body work or the uh, frame or engine love these KTM colours black and orange and white just looks superb upside down forks on these models are really a little sort of naked street street fighter type bike and um, oh, oh, the only scuff is there, I said there was no scuffs, but there was one there. They'd put an L plate here, and for some reason they had a metal backing on it to keep it sort of upright, and um, it had pushed onto here, which is really unfortunate. But um, that is the only paintwork mark on it. Wheels are in fabulous condition, as you can see. No marks on the wheels at all. Tyres are obviously less than 1,200 miles on them, so just beautiful condition. Refocus. Engine. This is a great looking engine as well. You can tell the components and everything are really high quality on the bike. Um, sticker there, that needs remove in I'll get rid of that before I sell it but um no sort of damage to any of the brakes pedals gear lever changes or anything like that again plastic fairing is in perfect condition as is the seat exhaust no scuffs on the exhaust either and the peg it's really really nice bike this absolutely love it looks great sounds great there's a slight mark on the sticker but that's not gone through to the wheel um that's i've no idea how they did that obviously maybe they were putting it away and it pushed up against something while they were backing it in because there's no damage to the tire or the actual wheel itself You know, exhaust. Actually quite a large outlet for the exhaust. And uh, full LED lights all the way around. All original KTM. No aftermarket lights on it. Um, as you can see, seat's beautiful condition. This just pops off. It's got a toolkit under the seat. I'll put a photograph of that on the screen. And um, tank is just beautiful i've machine polished the tank and waxed it and as you can see it's gorgeous there's only one tiny little mark there you can see my fingernail so the size of it is just tiny and um, it's got a replacement aftermarket um, clutch and brake levers these are really nice it's adjustable as well let's focus on that there it's adjustable, but it feels great. Just a really nice little hand on that. There you go. It's perfect. It's not like one of these two two finger ones. It's you know um, same for the other side. Again, adjustable brake lever as well. Really nice feeling thing. Really high quality. Oh, look, they fold away as well in case you have a crash. <laughs> Pretty clever, so that they don't break good quality components so looks to see the other one does it as well yep it does very clever 
Um, comes with a few options on this bike. Um, the screen is here, the tinted screen. Um, that is actually see-through. As you can just see there. And um, yeah, just really, really lovely. I love this light. I'll turn, in fact, I'll turn it on in a second, but it's got the full TFT screen as well, which is fantastic. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and start. I've got two keys. No, I'll explain the rest, but how cool is that? It means kill switch is on. There you go. Side stand is on as well. <laughs> really clever, isn't it? Well, I'll put the side stand up and show you that. There we go. So, shows the speed display, which actually comes up in that corner there. It's a neutral, and then it's six speed gearbox, not five on this. Tells you your battery voltage, the day, your trip meter, and then you've actually got all of these here, which you can cycle through. You just use these. It's actually got the optional um, Bluetooth on here as well. It didn't come standard. And um, you can pair your phone to it so you can answer phone calls. Um, you can turn the volume up and down. You can end the phone call. You can also um, flick through your tracks on your music and turn your volume up and down. Very, very clever. It's the first bike I've seen with that on. Superb feature. Um, so it's got 1,139 miles on it, and um, you've also obviously got your, your different information on there, but let's go ahead and start it up anyway. So it's even got a, like a, a light up um, thing for the, the button. Right, it's completely cold by the way, hand on the exhaust. Very, very cool bike. I love this. Also added on is this um, USB charger for your phone, which also does a voltage reading. How cool is that? <laughs> awesome, eh? So you can charge your phone to or two devices while you're riding, which is great. And um, the lights unusually are here, so you've got uh, normal beam full beam and then flash like that you've got your indicators let's go around and show you those all LED I always show all of this and uh, my favourite part look at that daytime running light absolutely awesome Let's switch the main beam on. Oh, superbly bright. Absolutely amazing. Flash it as well. It's like serious, um, serious good vision at night. Uh, so a lot of bikes lack decent lights at night. So, yeah. Um, okay, we can give it a bit of a rev. Now it's starting to warm up. Very light throttle, very easy bike to ride as well, and um, just a great all rounder. The ABS, it says this in the book as well. Um, let's just turn it off a second. So the ABS light stays on and it's ABS off, it stays on till about four kilometers an hour. Uh, it actually says that in the manual. I'll take a picture of that and put it on the screen. It's not a fault with the bike. Uh, I've got a BMW that does that as well. The ABS lights stay on until you over a certain speed. Um, so let's go through some things. It's got a uh, fuel gauge, temperature gauge, and this actually turns black at night. Um, so you have like a white display, uh, a black background and a white dial. Very clever. You've obviously got your gear selector here, and um, just awesome. Just really, really. Um, it tells you all your warnings here as well. You can switch them on and off. You can also switch the. Let's 
have a look. You can also switch off the so the switch uh, the switch light's cool. The shift light, sorry, when you it'll tell you when to shift gears for the better most economy. Very cool indeed. You can change the clock obviously and the kilometers and miles. Service um, next service 1467 miles so it doesn't need a service yet. And um, so KTM my ride you can you can um, I'll have to have a look what else you can do on there. Um, basically the yeah you can switch the somehow oh there you go you can switch the ABS on and off so if you're off the road you can switch that off. I mentioned it's got ABS I have now <laughs> so yeah let's just uh, fire the beast up again and I'm going to show you the exhaust tone. I'll show you the rear light as well, all LED. Got a nice tone to it, it's a nice deep tone, but it's not annoying at all. It's just a nice tone. Lovely sounding bag. No ticking or anything off the engine, obviously. Very bright brake lights. Okay, so what else comes with this cool bike? I absolutely love this. It comes with um, a full owner's handbook, but it's not just a you know not just the normal um, sort of service and warranty booklet. It comes with this sort of atta attaché case type thing. Um, Got the old KTM ready to race. This bike is based on its bigger brother, so in fact I've bought a little model with me to show you. So this is a 1290, the 1290 Super Duke R. And um, there you go. So if you look at the uh, headlights, very, 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 very similar bike. As you can see, let's go a bit further back. There you go. Pretty awesome, hey? So yeah, it's built to make it look like it's bigger brothers. From a distance, you can't tell this is a 125 at all. It's, I think it's the coolest 125 on the market, personally. Great riding position. Actually, quite a high seat seat height as well, or higher than normal, but um, it allows for a nice view of uh, cars and stuff while you're riding. Okay, so let's have a look through this book. Feast your eyes on this. Look how super cool this is. Yeah, awesome. So, this is what I like to see. Um, it's got a service and warranty book. Let's just focus on that. It's got the original handover sheet. It's got the service, 807 miles on September 2020. Um, that was the first service. Um, it comes with this magnetic backed book with a booklet inside and a couple of other things as well. So, yeah, very cool indeed. I've included a reg plate for the front of the bike here, so you can just stick that on. Also comes with the owner's manual here. All the information you need about the motorbike, you know, such as I don't know, taking the rear seat off and things like that. Um, it comes with a K KTM pen, yes, a KT actual KTM pen. So, very, very cool. It's all like hardware and stuff, yeah. So, spare set of keys as well. So, the other thing it comes with is other two things. So, look, it's really, really nice. Oxford bag, um, high quality, all waterproof, loads of pockets, it, it, goes, it actually straps down to the rear seat of the bike, you can strap it to the frame or wherever you want, it's got tons of pockets, and um, I'll take a few pictures of that and put them on the screen, 
all waterproof, look, all lined, all sealed, sorry, lined, sealed, good quality, um, extends as well, you can strap stuff under here, so it gives you a really um, adaptable bike for going, being able to go out for the day, put your chain and lock in there and stuff. And uh, these big things so you can fit your gloves through and pull them shut. And um, here's the strap down system here. It also comes with an Oxford Boss lock, high quality lock. Same colour as the KTM. Pretty cool. So yeah, it comes with the four keys and um, three Oxford bike lock keys as well. Okay, let's just take one more look at the bike before I um, put everything up. So if you're interested in this bike, give me a call. Uh, not a call, sorry, a message on Facebook or Instagram. Facebook is at Barrow Motorcycle Sales. Just look that up on Facebook on there. You can ask me anything you want about the bike. I will answer any questions you like. And um, even if you think they're silly, don't worry about it. Just ask away. I give really high quality customer service from start to fit, start to sale point and um, absolutely beautiful bike and this is a really good price as well for it if you want to know that just ask and um, I'll answer that. Thank you very much guys.